What if we did every item is, but changed it randomly per floor? Welcome back, everybody. Today's challenge should be a fun one. To pull this off, we are gonna be using a random number generator. This one's just on Google. And we know that item IDs go all the way up to 732. Per floor, we'll choose a new number. Every item on that floor will be whatever that item ID is. First floor, go. 692. Open up the rules mod. There might be a way to program this into rules, but I don't know that. If you know how to do that, help me out. All items replaced by <laughs> Sanguine Bond. This is not off to a good start. I suppose if we get something like this, we could just try to, I don't know, go faster or even skip the item room, right? We don't need multiple Sanguines. I don't think they stack for any reason. Of course, Sanguine Bond giving you the spikes in your devil room that you can jump on to get potentially devil items, but also black hearts and some stats. So I guess this gives us an opportunity to potentially pull off a planetarium in the future, but that planetarium will also be filled with that random item. Don't really have to sweat re-rolling the machine. Just try to get some extra cash here. Or that soul heart, that'd be nice. Is it worth it risking the curse room? I guess for the soul hearts it would be. No soul hearts here. Okay, thanks. What's up, Tim? Hey, what's up, man? Oh, God! We got our soul heart. A lot of red hearts on this floor. Maybe we can jump on some spikes. Sacrifice spikes. No sacrifice spikes? Fine. If only we could jump on the sanguine bond spikes. Baby plum. Kind of a tough first boss, I'm not gonna lie. Very high shot speed, and then this is sometimes undodgeable. Pro tip, don't shoot it while it's freaking out like that. It just makes life difficult. Just let him go. Just let him go. Our first and only sanguine bond for the floor will be after this. It's totally fine. Once again, one is all you need. Maybe one of the floors will just give me a bunch of health upgrades, and then we can use all that health to jump on the sanguine spikes to then get damage ups. That's the plan, that's the current plan. Oh, there was sacrifice spikes. Oh, you big dummy, you could have just jumped on them. But now I picked up the soul heart. Gosh darn it, I swear, I just, I was gonna say I have the memory of a goldfish, but in reality, if I'm not excited about something, my brain doesn't put the work in to log that away. AKA my RAM, very small. Alt path. Um, not the first one. We don't need to. I guess to check it out with the golden key and everything. See what we get here. Nothing. A bunch of nothing. Don't need to go all path, though, because it's going to give me two options. Both are going to be the same thing. Which reminds me, we don't want to do all items. We want to do all items except quest items. That's just the one you should always do. And now that we're here, let's generate a new number. 672. Wow, we're going high. It's, oh. 672 is pound of flesh. You know, hey, maybe this could be good. Pound my flesh, daddy. This item causes devil deals to cost money instead of hearts. So now we can save our hearts to jump on the sanguine bond. Boom. Or, you know, buy things from the shop. That's poop. This seems like a good room to use this in. Try to get some of these pots. All that money we got from those pots is really nice. It is super nice. Stat up if I stand in the diarrhea. These are just not things that you get to say normally, you know? Blessed are we. Literally talking about anything that has to do with the bonding of Isaac to someone that does not play the game makes you look like a psychopath. A psychopath? I was crazy once. They locked me in a room. They locked me in a room. Wait, 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 hey, I will. I suppose multiple pounds of flesh does not stack again. So skipping the item room once more. Riveting. This has been a riveting every item is, hasn't it been? How did you both miss that bomb? These are speedy gurglings. They don't spawn anything, but they are speedy. Ouch. One down. Okay. Oh. Yes. Pound my flesh. Oh, you know, I should have tried to get 15 cents before we got here. Of course, what's to buy, but more pounds of flesh. The only problem that we could face here is getting an angel room. I, I didn't think I would say it, but I think getting an angel room would be slightly problematic with this build. Do I go in? I don't know. Do I jump on a pound of flesh? I mean, the, the sanguine bond? Whatever, you know what I'm talking about. Give up my soul hearts? It seems silly, but... Hey, we got some black hearts. They're kind of blocking... Oh, you know what? I can actually stand on this. That's totally fine. Okay, I'm gonna pay from here then. Yeah, I'm gonna go a little bit deeper. One more... Oh, I picked up the money. But I mentioned my RAM is really small, and that's my RAM. 
We got nothing. At least we got the black cards back, I suppose. This probably top secret room. Oh, if only we had like a goat head. Secret room. Ooh, something I can't get. Very cool. Oh boy, envy fight. This is peak Isaac. They're not all gonna be winners. At least we locked in devil deals. I guess. Would I do alt path this time for the second boss? You know, if it's a really good item, I might brave another boss to get it. Next item, 117. That is dead bird. Do dead bird stack? When Isaac takes damage, dead bird will spawn and attack nearby enemies in the current room for two damage per tick. You could have picked up a, a, one more rock. God, this floor is full of hacks. Uh, oh, Seagram's got pills. Pills could be good. <laughs> Immediately, poop self. Range down. Oh, that one's okay. Am I gonna go into my item room? I suppose. Come on, dude. Don't get me wrong, the bird's really good, but on damage effects are not gonna take me through the run. They cannot carry because I have to take damage. Polished bone? Yeah, bony buddies. 25% chance to spawn a friendly bony. Got you a friendly bony right here, huh? Damn it, who let Tim back in? The elves of blood. It's, it could be a tough fight on the flip side. Won't get no bird to help me out with this when I'm lost. Maybe I'll get another bomb or something like that and I'll just blow him up. Oh my God, I'm struggling with no damage upgrades. How do I do this? All right, bird's turn to carry. Get him, bird. I'm barely hanging on here just trying to control the leeches. Oh my God. Ah! You bad a bird, dude. You got him. You got him. It's nice. And, oh, it's so painful when it shows me what it replaced. I'm going in. I'm going all out. All in, all out, whatever. You know what I mean? Would I use this money to buy another bird? No, I'm going to save the money. This has been a huge failure. Oh, keeper sack. Oh, that's right. I can't buy anything because it costs health. Bro, I'm circling the drain here. How about a boss trap room? That's right. It's going to be another bird. <laughs> here, here we go. That's, I'm dead. I'm already dead, you guys. I have no stats. And I'm going to fight two dross boss boss drosses one down another beelzebub of course gotta save some bombs for the other boss the other beelzebub well yes i am a professional dodger do i really need to go get another bird no i i really don't i do need to see what's in here though Mm -hmm. Going to the next floor. This has been a huge mistake. Huge mistake. Next number, 440. That's Kidney Stone. We got to do one battle room in order to switch off from Lost. Make this work to our advantage by going immediately into the curse room. Hierophant. Perfect. Just death it. Just death it out. And I got a bony. All right, we're back. Random pill. Go. Random bullshit. Go. Bony, don't get too close. <laughs> You took my only bony. Now I'm gonna starve. Oh boy. It's such a crapshoot to go into this room. I feel like they act differently every single time. Oh, is there not some predictable pattern? Ooh. Oh. <laughs> we don't need multiple kidney stones either. To my knowledge, they do not stack. Can I get something that stacks, please? So I got three birds? That look like triple damage bird to you? No. So you're telling me the bird doesn't stack. Great. This has been the worst challenge I've ever done. Hey, Devil's Crown. Treasure rooms are replaced with devil deals. So instead of free items, I have to pay for them. Great. Speaking of great, yep. This is great. We're not even one-shotting these tiny little guys. That's how bad this run is. I can see forever. I take those. Um, yeah, maybe a tr like a better trinket could help me out here. Soul Heart could help me out. Cards could be good. Yeah, or like nothing could be cool too that that'd be nice okay more bird oh come on more pill yep doesn't get better than this this is peak isaac you may not like it room with money one kidney stone will help but i gotta be honest it's looking pretty grim here i don't know how else to put this other than uh-oh gary and queen screw it i'm i'm calling on the birds call on me call on me call on me call on me soul of eve is really good super good thanks guys there's my one kidney stone let's go come on new item be a stackable Stat increase. Please, 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 please. Drum roll. Hit it. One, two, three. As easy as A, B, C. Monster manual. All right, all right. Potential bookworm. And we'll have an active item that we can finally use. If it gives me good stuff, I got no complaints. 
That's good stuff. I honestly think that's one of the best part about these challenges, or challenges in general, is they really make the crap shine. They make you appreciate all the items that you normally skip. And by appreciate, I mean I'm gonna die horribly and hate the game and uninstall it. Golden Bomb is spicy though. Need a flight card for this room. Going into my item room and oh, teleport 2.0. <laughs> I mean, Monster Manual is so much better than that. What do you got? The happiest little chub. We can get multiple charges, or even just like some lucky battery drops. Monster Manual might take me there. With the golden bomb, I probably should just be bombing everybody. Well, I had a bony friend. That's nice though. Second charge, Monster Manual. Succubus, yes! And a planetarium, okay. That will be the source of my third Monster Manual, the second of which being in the boss room. And we got a tiny Tomo with that. Hey, reverse devil activates the Bible. Last for 30 seconds. I could probably get those chests in 30 seconds. And then we also have a reverse moon card. Teleports me to my ultra secret room. Uh, we'll maybe save that for a floor where we have a better item. All right, give me that flight. Give me some good stuff here. Make it worth my while. I'm out of keys already. I didn't see that coming. I guess we're gonna use a flight to get into here too. Black heart. Got all these bonies too. And GB bug turn monster manual that gives me the transformation now, as well as a Bob's brain. I'm actually totally cool with Bob's brain. If I could get a permanent Bob's brain, I'd take it at this point in time. Be a huge source of DPS for us. Uh, another book. I'll take more friends. I'll take more friends for sure. What did we get? A cube of meat. Monster Manual is putting in the work, and I appreciate that. And that's a reverse strength card. Enemies in current room are weakened, slowed, and take double damage. Last for one minute. Let's use that now and take reverse moon with us when we leave. Bombing all the skulls here. Been working so far. That's an ace of hearts. And my bonies jumped on the spikes. Great. Give me a room with a ton of enemies in it, please. Oh, just tons. That's so many enemies. Monster Manual! Another succubus! They do stack. Multiple succubi is so good. Boss time! Reverse strength! Oh my gosh, you got crushed. Is that another Monster Manual? Holy moly. I should have saved the charge. There's no reason why I, I needed to use it now. I'm drunk with power. I, I can't be stopped. Deal with the devil. A bunch of Monster Manuals. Checks out. Would I? Would I jump on the spikes? You don't think I would, do you? That was plus damage, maybe. I think 0.93 damage. It's hard to tell with all the succubusins. That's what I'm... Yes! One of the black hearts. And the damage. And then one more play. Oh, excellent. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who just exploded? One of my bonies. You guys, I'm jumping on the spikes, not you. That's my job. Already dead, and they're just begging to be re-dead. It's the human form of refried beans. Next floor, hope for the best. As soon as we start taking double damage, we are in trouble. Five, four, three, two, one, send it. Five, 21. Feels good, it's gonna be a good one. <gasps> no way. Every item is coupon. This is the worst, this is the actual worst. Reverse moon card, I will not be using you today. Okay, good one, that's a good one. That's, I, I, I don't need another coupon. Nor do I need to get into my devil room. So just keep looking good there, bud. Proceed unmolested. There goes my family. Pound of Flesh just makes it so that I don't even care about my shops anymore. Why should I? I mean, I, I guess I could potentially see if I could get one with the coupon, but like one what? What, what do we want? Another coupon? <laughs> Monster Manual, save me. Yeah. Is that uh, Forever Alone? Oh. Ooh. Bomb for uh, a micro battery? Hell yes. More Monster Manual help me, Brother Bobby. Oh my goodness, that dude just immediately jumped directly down my throat. Awas, um, once again, don't really need another coupon. It's a black market for tons of coupons. Oh boy. Is it even worth it to go to my item room? I don't think so. Maybe doing this extra large L room here for another charge. What do we got? Robo baby 2.0. This run's really highlighting how many items are very mediocre. How many items don't stack too. Ooh, that's nice. Mom fight. Hope for better next floor, please. Come on, kidney stone. I'm just going from one kidney stone to the next. I suppose I should be focusing on my fly a little bit more, too. 
Uh-huh. That's good damage. That's good damage. There it is. That's it. Polaroid. Makes no sense to go dark room and get the red chests. Might as well get the items for free, yeah? Womb will be interesting. There's no shop. There's no item room. Every item is game kid. Oh my god. There's so many trash actives. Maybe, maybe redoing this challenge and forcing every single item to just be a passive could be a more fun way to experience this. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. I don't know how I would program that. I'd probably just have to sit there and re-roll and re-roll until I got a passive. Once again, love to hear your thoughts. Once again, not worth using my moon card, my reverse moon card. Monster man, you will save me. The same fly. Faster we get to the boss. I was, I was gonna say faster the better, but maybe not. If we get easy rooms to charge up our book and then we get some, some good friends, it really, really does help. But we could also just get really tough rooms and get pooed on. I could also just use my black hearts to just uh, clear everything. Yeah, super smart. That's that's what I wanted to do. Totally intentional. We're doing so bad. I can't express how bad that we are doing. Monster manual ghost baby and a justice. Justice. Double speed chub. Thanks, kidney stone. Like we're surviving. We're kind of doing this. This is gonna be a tough fight. All the RNG spikes. Gosh, I hate them so much. Well, ah, they just don't telegraph. There's no telegraphing. Ah! You did not. Wait, what? I dropped my book and it turned into the Game Kid. Why did I not think that that was gonna happen? Every single item is Game Kid. It turned my book into the Game Kid. Now we're good. I mean, I guess I get my health back with the Game Kid, if I'm trying to be positive about that. Monster Manual was like kinda good though. <laughs> Next floor, generate. I've lost all hope, chat. 101, holy crap! Every item is Halo. And all stats, are you sure? Definitely gonna reverse moon card here. This is it, please. Find some way to give me more of them. We have 100% devil chance, but we have no soul heart protection. I got a bunch of piddly nothing for stats right now, and I gotta make it to the boss and get past the boss. Entering a new floor grants plus one bone heart. I'm gonna stick with the polished bone. I think the bone dudes are gonna be pretty necessary here. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna game kid this one. Screw these guys. Four room recharge on that. That's not that bad. Please let me get my devil room. No, I went the wrong way. This is a stupid map. Oh gosh, this is gonna be worth it. Stupid nose guys. These flying noses. Still the wrong way. Oh my frick! Devil deal gone. This is crap. This is absolute crap. This is crap. If I use my active item correctly, I can get health. Big if there. Give me a room full of enemies that I can eat for health. Would I go into here? It's too late. Please. You know what I want. Just give it to me. Yes! That's exactly what I wanted. Would I go for another one? <laughs> Let's save our money for the deal with the devil. See if I can't pull it off. I'm gonna be using bombs here. Probably just pop my active to get through this. And an eternal heart. You spoil me. Back on top, baby. Oh my gosh, Seraphim, I don't even expect that. Honestly, we should be jumping on the spikes here, probably, maybe. Leviathan transformation. Is that normal? Plus two black hearts. Goodbye. Okay, we're just getting a bunch of nothing. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's the good stuff. Yes, I accept those. Take this one. Jump on the spikes a little bit more. Okay, do something here. Okay, black hearts are good. Can I actually give one of them up? I can't hold four. Okay, that's more. One more. Yes! Now I can only hold two black hearts. More damage. Okay, that's where we're gonna stop. But you know what? The bone heart, I guess. I guess I could black heart, give it up for nothing. Sweet. And then take the b bone heart, then black heart, and then this random pill. Cool. Huge strides if I can pull this together. Give this guy a bunch of money. Yeah, I guess the rotten hearts could be cool. He has a chance of paying out with an item. There it is. There goes my black heart. Not the best feeling, but seven all stats ups. That makes up for 
almost everything else. I can almost go into my boss trap room. Is that crazy for me to want to do more rooms so that I can get more charges on my active item, the game kid, and play the blood donation machine? Ugh. Is that too greedy to ask for eight all stats ups? Oh, that's right. Battery room. And go. Okay, like the money's cool and all, but like more all stats? Question mark. I think that's a full clear. All right, seven all stats up is amazing. Four, three, three fire rate, eight, nine, four damage. Like possibly could pull this off. My range is also back up. That feels really good. Eternal heart, cathedral. Come on to the chest. Rolling on this floor will be largely symbolic. Probably not gonna see an item here, but if we did, it would be the pact. Oh man, that would be so good. Damage plus tears. Come on, golden chests. Or secret rooms. Secret rooms could have an item in it. Follows Isaac's exact movement, copies Isaac's stats, and deals half damage. Dies in one hit though. I'm gonna try this. See if we can't double up here on all of our stuff. Look at that. Look at how many shots we're shooting out. Amazing. Suppose I can use my active item to try to get an item in here. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, can I just eat them all? Can I eat them all quick and then get out the door? Please let me do that. Out the door. Go, 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 go. No! There was a red heart that dropped in there too. Well, I can grab that uh, charge key, go back in for it. Soul heart in the ground. I can't even take soul hearts anymore. <laughs> kind of a, maybe a mistake to take that much red health, but no. They were all stats. I'm not gonna not take them. God dang it. What? How did that shot hit my little buddy? Get the big guy first. You might be able to get uh, eternal D6 drop from the little guy. Oh, okay. Or we just take out the little guy. We just eat him. We did, yes, we got it. Damage plus tears. We are maxed out, capped on our fire rate. No one saw this coming. Once again, rip the soul hearts that we could have gotten from the pact. Oh well, oh, good shot. Oh my gosh. What is up with these stupid floors being stupid? Just a big old bucket of dumb. Seagram's got some sack. What's this? Reverse fool card. Drops all of Isaac's hearts, but one, and all of his pickups on the floor. Coins and bombs are dropped as quarter and boom. Guess what they're gonna turn into? I should wait till I have one more bomb. Then I will drop a boom and it will turn into magic. And that's not a bomb. Bomb in here, there it is. Oh, you know what? 99 cents is not the best either because it's gonna drop a dollar and then instead of three quarters, right? If I had 98 cents, it would drop three quarters. Huh, I don't have an answer. I don't know how to get rid of a penny. Like it is what it is, just go. Ended up dropping three quarters anyways. I guess it works. I guess that totally works. Damage plus tears, damage plus tears. This is obviously just damage since we're capped on fire rate. That's plus 1.46 damage. I mean, in the end, maybe not a whole lot, but better than nothing. I really thought it dropped a dollar at 99 cents though. I mean, I understand why it doesn't. Oh, red hearts, they're so good. Can I have more? Yes. Isaac Fye, let's go. I'm super reinvigorated right now. I'm feeling good. Hopefully, 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 hopefully we get something good for the chest floor. Please. You know what? Eat these guys for health. We didn't get any health. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. We're gonna do it. Kidney stone, thank you. More health. All right. The victory might hinge on this last roll. Generate. One, nine, seven. That's a Jesus juice. We like damage here. Jesus juice. Bye-bye <laughs> C-section. Hello, Jesus juice. 12 damage, okay? It's good. It's a good thing. Zero luck right now, so we're probably not gonna get too many more chests. But we're gonna win. This is all we need. I'm telling you. Let's keep my little buddy alive, too. He's dealing six damage. Uh, who's the most likely? Oh, excuse me. The pale with an item here. Any and all of them, probably. No item. We get an item here. Yes. 12, 3, 8 damage. This is doing it for me. Hopefully we find the boss soon as well. Chat, I really, really, really did not think that we were gonna succeed. And I didn't think that this was gonna be this big of a challenge. I thought this was gonna be kind of easy. And it totally could have been, of course, if we had gotten like a really, really good item. But man, they held out on us for a while. What's that card? Sun card? Full health? Oh, that basically just guarantees the victory. Would love to know your thoughts on this challenge in the comment section down below. 
Would you like to see more of this or would you not? Ow. Oh, that almost got me and my buddy. Oh, that's not even fun. Oh, that's not even fun. Little buddy down. More juice, though. Full health. I feel like I don't even have to try. I mean, I'm still gonna try. Oh, that's right, my birds. Get in there! You're done. You're done. Phenomenal stuff, everybody. Wow, 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 wow. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate all of your support. Once again, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Do all the cool stuff like leave comments and hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you are not subscribed and you want to see more of this. It really does help me a lot. And there's nothing left to say, but I will see you in the next one. See you guys.